reported on several neglected apartment buildings in the greater Lansing area that are infested with cockroaches and bed bugs. Yeah, we know state law requires landlords to provide a safe and livable apartment, but as you've seen, that does not always happen. And many times it leaves people with nowhere to go. So Kyle Macon talked with the lawyer. He's here for you now with what you can do to get some help. Kyle? Sherry Siobhan, lawyers recommend that before you reach out for legal help that you sit down with your landlord and try to resolve the issue. But if that fails, you can start out by reaching out to your city's code enforcement and telling them your concerns. The lawyers I spoke to said the first thing they will recommend is opening up an escrow account, which basically means you're holding on to your rent in a bank account and will only release the money if they fix your issues. But to do this, you must notify your landlord in a written letter what you want fixed and that you're beginning to open an escrow account. But remember, this does not mean you get to stay there for free. It does not mean you will never have to pay rent. So for example, if you escrow your rent for the coming month and the landlord repairs your toilet or whatever other repair is needed, then you're supposed to release or pay your rent at that time. So it does not mean that you don't have to pay rent it's a way of holding on to your rent to motivate your landlord to make the required repairs. Now, if you don't take the necessary steps to make an escrow account and stop paying your rent, you can be evicted. So if you or anyone is being taken advantage of by your landlord, we'd love to hear it. We will also be providing resources for renters on our website at WLNS.com. Sherry, Siobhan, back to you.